Um, Sean Ryder gets offered drugs on a daily basis despite being clean for the past 14 years. He said people are always offering him lines in the shops and everything. <laughs> people like that, you're going down to do your, do your Tesco shop and everything, or down, walking around like picking up your cereal and whatever, and they would say, do you want a quick line off the, off the, uh, off the bran flakes? No, mate, I'm fucking clean, I don't want any. Go on then. I mean, in the pub and everything, maybe you'll fucking, after a few drinks, you might go, oh, fuck it, go on, I'll have a, a cheeky one. But not in the fucking, you know, toilet roll aisle, where there's plenty of counter space to, to get one off because there's no fucking toilet roll. Um, but still, hey, but he's uh, he said he's clean, so good on him. But he said he'd rather people keep, fuck, he likes it, he likes people that prefer him, them to uh, drill him about this music. Drill him about his drug taking, should I say, than about the music. It's just because people are always asking him things like, uh, is it in E or B minor? And, you know, how did you come up with that song? And, like, you know, what was your, what was your, uh, uh, what does it mean? What's the meaning behind it and all that? And he said that bores him to tits. So uh, he'd rather people talk to him about drugs. That's what they're all about, anyway, isn't they? When you think of Sean Ryder and Bears, straight away you think of fucking drug taking and whatever anyway good on him he said he's nearly 60 don't matter as long as you're young and you're still fucking you know you're not partying too hard you can still uh, uh i'm not saying fucking party <laughs> i'm just saying you can't say i'm nearly 60 i can't do this that and the other you can still fucking do what you like just you know drink and enjoy yourself enjoy music you don't have to just automatically become an old person but it's good that you don't take drugs no more you know it's, it's a young man's game, isn't it? You can't go out all night and fucking wake up in somebody else's house. <laughs> you know, or not even wake up. Stand, find yourself stood in somebody's kitchen at 12 o'clock the next day and you're 60 and they're all 20. You'd be like, how the fuck, what happened? I only fucking bumped into somebody weighing, it, weighing my bananas in Tesco and that was like fucking I found myself here upside down in somebody's house. That's what happens when you take drugs, you see. Apparently, how would I know?